Hi guys, it's Jamie, the owner of Not Too Shabby. We have a brand new digital stamp release today. So I'm excited to share the brand new drawing here. And I can't wait for you guys to color this up. I've created this in three different styles for you. So this is the gingerbread latte digital image. You'll also get this image in not only that grungy style that I love to create, but the clean line look here. So we have a yummy gingerbread latte with two cinnamon sticks, a little gingerbread man sticking out, a yummy cupcake. We've got some greenery and berries. So here is the third look. This one is a no line coloring. You can print this out. It's like a faded line. So when you color it with your markers, you won't be able to see the line. So it gives you that nice no line coloring look. So I'm going to do some coloring here. I'm using my favorite reddish brown combination that E99, E97, and E95. It's perfect for all kinds of things that you want reddish brown. So the cinnamon sticks, gingerbread men, it's perfect for foxes, pumpkins, hair, just to name a few things. So I'm going to go ahead and color this image in. I go from dark to lightest and then I usually color my images in twice. Um, I always love to do that. It gives it a nice rich look. Um, if your coloring doesn't look the greatest on the first pass, I say always give it another coat. Um, go over everything twice and it looks so much better. So sit back and enjoy the coloring. I'll post a photo at the end of the video of the finished card. I'm just going to mat this on um, an A2 size folding card base and maybe add a sentiment. Um, probably add some glitter and some white jelly roll highlights. So when you're printing out this digital image, what I did here was I just change the quantity to four and it'll print four on this um, regular size printer paper but use Copic paper and then you can just cut this in fours and or you can cut it out with your dies and then it'll fit perfectly on an A2 size card. Now if you want this a little bit smaller print it out six. I'd love to know your opinion in the comments down below which line art style do you like best? My grungy look, my clean line look, or the no line look? So let me know down below. I'd love to hear it. Maybe I'll turn this image into a photopolymer stamp next year.